Hey guys and welcome to Cast and Forge. In today's video I'd like to show you my first try on a homemade smelting furnace to produce iron. I start with a hole in the ground, it's about 10 cm deep. As you can see I set up some gas concrete blocks for my furnace walls. I used small stones and a mixture of mud and clay to support the lower part of the furnace. That's the area where the most heat is concentrated. I let the finished furnace dry for about a day before the first firing. I used a 1 inch pipe to connect my blower with the furnace. I put the pipe in vinegar to remove the zinc coating. After I lit a small wood fire I start feeding the first charcoal in the furnace. My raw material was a mixture of rust, which is basically iron oxide, and scale from old forgings. I fed my smelting furnace in layers with my raw material and charcoal. I let the furnace burn for several hours to use up all my raw material. Once the bed of coals lowers in the furnace, I use new charcoal and raw material to fill it up. That's an inside view of the furnace. Once I used up all my material, I let the coals burn down. The next step is to open up the furnace and search for the bloom of iron. As you can see there's a lot of slack due to the gas concrete blocks. The task now is to separate the bloom from the slack. And those little pieces of iron were the results of my furnace. It's not much, but it's workable. If you like my video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching and see you next time.